Hello everyone and welcome to my Bachelor Nation 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Curse of Oak Island. The team takes a surprise fifth shot at finding treasure at the money pit. This week on The Curse of Oak Island, Rick Lagina shocked everyone by announcing there would be a fifth case in place at the Money Pit in yet another Season 9 attempt to locate the Chapel Vault. This was a super exciting episode with the drama ramped up to the max. It really felt like the guys were getting closer and closer to the treasure with each hammer grab. And that's why it was so frustrating when it suddenly ended in disappointment. However, this disappointment did not last long. The episode began with Gary Drayton's usual chirpy attitude. This is the day we find the treasure, he said for the umpteenth time this season. But any cynicism started melting away once the drilling reached the 150-foot mark. The chapel vault is thought to be at the 153-feet point, and as they neared that mark, they suddenly began finding really old axe-cut wood. They also came across clay, a substance William Chapel's men came across in 1931, just before they pierced the vault. Oak Island's Shaft 4 ended empty-handed at the Money Pit. The excitement started building with each scoop of dirt as the guys prepared to finally hit the vault. Suddenly, the drill hit a void and began rapidly descending. Then, worse news, the drill struck bedrock, meaning it was game over. Viewers had been told this would be the last shot at the money pit for this season. However, Rick Lagina had a nice, albeit somewhat shocking, surprise for everyone. The drilling had proceeded faster than expected, and the guys still have a few more weeks on the island before winter sets in, which means they have the time and the money for a fifth shaft and another go at finding the vault. All that was left was to decide where to put shaft number five. It was promptly agreed without any argument that the new dig location would be just one foot to the north of the old C1 shaft and almost directly above the old B4 borehole. The honor of naming the new shaft fell to Scott Barlow, who christened it B4C after the B4 borehole with an added C for Kaysen. Marty Lagina joked, So it's the hole we dug just before. Before, we found the treasure. New fifth shaft in area of money pit with high level of gold and silver. As Jack Begley detailed the reasons why the C1 spot would make a suitable location, viewers may be forgiven for wondering why on earth they had in place the case in can there before now. This area of the money pit saw the highest concentration of gold and silver in the underground water following Dr. Spooner's test. They've also found pieces of metal with fragments of gold, and they've uncovered wood dating all the way back to the 15th century. It's likely the fellowship was put off this location because they have already dug two 10-diameter shafts on either side of C1. TF1 and EC1 were dug in 2017 and 2020, respectively. And frankly, they spectacularly failed to reveal any treasure-laden vaults. However, there's still plenty of unexplored earth down there, so fingers crossed. The new shaft will be placed just a few feet to the north of C1 and the two other old shafts. Unless there are some really extraordinary circumstances, this will definitely be the guy's final shot this season at finding the money pit. The Fellowship of the Dig have once again shown off their resilience and never-say-die attitude. They are absolutely determined to find the Oak Island treasure and are prepared to push themselves to the limits to get it. The sky over Oak Island was a campus of restless clouds, painted in hues of silver and gray, as the familiar hum of machinery echoed across the landscape. The Lagina brothers, Rick and Marty, stood at the precipice of the Money Pit, a location that had both tantalized and tormented treasure hunters for over two centuries. Today, with hearts full of hope and minds buzzing with anticipation, they were about to take their fifth shot at uncovering the fabled riches buried deep within the island's enigmatic soil. Rick, with his rugged features etched with determination, glanced at his younger brother, 
fifth time's the charm, right? He said, attempting to inject a bit of levity into the tension-filled air. Marty, ever the pragmatist, gave a small smile. Let's hope so. We've come too far to turn back now. The team had spent years unraveling the mysteries of Oak Island, piecing together a puzzle that spans centuries, continents, and countless lives. The money pit, with its labyrinthine tunnels, booby traps, and unfathomable depths, remained the island's most tantalizing enigma. Previous excavations had yielded tantalizing clues. Bits of parchment, ancient artifacts, and even traces of gold. But the ultimate prize had always eluded them. As the drilling rig roared to life, the ground beneath them seemed to tremble with anticipation. The team gathered around, each member bringing their own unique expertise and passion to the quest. There was Craig Tester, the methodical engineer, Jack Begley, the fearless adventurer, Alex Lagina, the next generation treasure hunter, and a host of experts who had dedicated their lives to solving the riddle of Oak Island. All right, everyone, let's do this. Rick called out, his voice carrying a blend of command and camaraderie. We've got one shot today, so let's make it count. The drill began its descent, biting into the earth with a relentless determination. The air was thick with tension, each second stretching into an eternity as the team watched the progress meter inch downward. Conversations were hushed, eyes locked on the machinery that held the promise of a breakthrough. As the drill reached deeper, the ground seemed to resist, a stubborn guardian of its ancient secrets. Sweat glistened on foreheads, and the occasional glance was exchanged, unspoken questions hanging in the air. Was today the day? Would they finally breach the vault that had eluded so many before them? Hours passed, and the sun began its slow descent, casting long shadows across the island. The drill had reached depths that had never been explored before, each foot bringing them closer to the heart of the mystery. Suddenly, a shudder ran through the machinery, a tremor that seemed to reverberate through the very ground they stood on. Hold up, hold up. Marty shouted, his eyes narrowing as he studied the readings. We've hit something. The team rushed forward, peering into the drill hole with bated breath. The air was electric with excitement, a palpable sense of discovery hanging in the balance. Slowly, carefully, they extracted the core sample, a cylinder of earth that held the potential to change everything. Rick held the sample in his hands, his heart pounding in his chest. Let's see what we've got, he said, his voice fairly above a whisper. They gathered around the table, eyes fixed on the core as it was carefully examined. Layers of soil, rock, and sediment gave way to something unexpected. A glint of metal, a flash of gold. Gasps of disbelief echoed through the room, followed by a burst of excitement. Is that? Jack began, his eyes wide with astonishment. It's gold, Craig confirmed, his voice tinged with awe. We found gold. The room erupted in cheers, the culmination of years of hard work, relentless pursuit, and unwavering belief. Yet, even as they celebrated, there was a sense of caution. The gold was a clue, a piece of the puzzle, but it was not the end of their journey. The true treasure, the fabled riches of Oak Island, still lay hidden, buried deeper within the island's ancient heart. As night fell, the team gathered around a campfire, the flickering flames casting dancing shadows across their faces. The island, with its darkened silhouette and whispering trees, seemed to hold its breath, as if waiting for the next chapter of its story to unfold. Rick looked around at his team, his friends, his family. We've come so far, and we've found so much. But the real treasure isn't just gold or jewels. It's the journey, the adventure, and the bonds we formed along the way. Marty nodded, his eyes reflecting the firelight. And we're not done yet. The money pit still holds its secrets, and we're going to find them together.